Hi everyone, I'm Akila. In this video, let us see who are all the customers who have not made any purchases or sales for with us. So in fact, internet sales, we know there is a transaction data, all sales data. Uh, this is a fact table. Coming to the dim customer, it's a dimension table where you will have all the customer details. So let's start from dim customer. This dimension table of dim customer is maintaining all the customer's records. So if you want to know whether a customer has done any transaction, you may need to take this customer data and check in the fact internet sales table to figure out whether he has done any transactions. So I have to do a let join on dim customer and join with fact internet sales. So I will get all the customer details and matching transaction details. If there is no transaction record, it means that customer has not done any sale. So how will I check that? I can check based on any particular key, right? Instead of uh, filter, uh, displaying all the row, entire row. We'll see how it works. So let me put on the query and you'll understand better. Let's join fact internet sales now you know why i have done dim customer left join fat internet sales yes dot on yes dot customer key equals customer alias dot customer key i'm joining both the tables and instead of uh, displaying all the rows let me display customer table customer key comma sales table customer key as well as sales key whatever you want okay let, let, let just let it be customer key so if i execute this query you'll see you understand this customer key is from the customer table the second column is from the sales table so i will have a null value an empty value in the second column where that respective customer has not done any transactions for that uh, period or something so how will i find out that means we need only we are looking for only those customers right we should write a wait condition where sales table customer key is now so if i execute i'll get output see it means there is no output it means there are no customers who have not done any purchases with us it means it means happy happy that all the customers are doing transactions with us they are doing some purchases with us okay to make it very simple without touching this adventures work data let me go with my database and explain you like show you the data aspect if the data is limit <laughs> you'll understand better so i have created a table customer table dbo.customer i'm just executing this query it got only seven rows with customer key columns okay one two three four five six seven it's in a sequence okay let, let us make it very simple so that the same thing what i have done before i'm showing with your limited data you'll understand better so let's start from and i have another table called fat internet sales fat internet sales let me zero this and show you it got three columns sales key customer key customer key is a foreign key in this table and customer key is a primary key and only column in the customer table and this is the sale amount see we know that there are seven customers right but here we got only these nine transactions so let us find out who has not made any transactions same logic select star from customer c Let's join fat internet sales. Yes, on s dot customer key equals c dot customer key. Okay, let me execute this and we'll see the output first. See, it is giving null for the row, entire row where there is no transaction. So instead of retrieving the entire columns from the fact internet sales table what we can do is customer table dot customer key comma sales table alias dot customer key let me execute this alone see i'm getting 
both the call tables, customer key column, and it is written in null based on the left join of the customer table. So now I want the only rows where customer key from the sales table is null, where s dot customer key is null. Execute. See, means there is one customer whose customer key is seven who has not made any purchases till now. So we can take some, we can offer him some discounts and you can make him as a regular transactor. Okay, fine. Hope it's useful. Thank you.